Hello Collective and welcome back to my channel, Luma Moon Tarot. So everybody, I am here checking in behind the scenes with the soulmates and separation, seeing what the situation is, what's going on, right? Um, this reading is for the collective. You can be any sign for collective readings, okay? If something pulled you in from the title, there's something in it for you. But just don't don't try to squish it into your into your story, okay? Don't try to force anything. And thank you so much, everyone, for your likes, subscribes, all of the comments you guys give me. Thank you so much. You guys show me nothing but kindness out here, and I'm so grateful. Thank you so much for all of your support. All right, Divine, what do you have for the collective today? Messages for the collective. Ooh. Oh, boy. Someone out here feels crushed lost without you maybe ghosted blocked off they could have even been um there they could be having some money problems they could owe like uh, child support alimony they could even have some kind of court case going on that's going to take a while right they know they need to clean this up whatever this is get their money straight go through some kind of court case that could take days, weeks, or months before they can come back to you. But this person, they want to make you some kind of offer. They may even come in asking to propose. I feel like this person's going through some money problems, and they don't know what to do about it. Um, yeah, expect a pop-up visit. This person's absolutely obsessed about you. Wow. Uh, this is definitely somebody from your past, and I feel like you're closing out that cycle, Collective. When this person comes towards you, I feel like they're coming in with a proposal, I got to say. I feel like they're, they're going to just spontaneously, spontaneously pop up out, out of nowhere, out of the blue. Um, they're going to tell you they must have you, they're in love with you, they, they want to get married, and you're going to be like, ah, 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 not so fast. <laughs> not so fast. You need to prove some things to me. Show me that you're not just here to use me. Show me that you're not just here to take advantage of my abundance, right? Because I feel like this person is secretly going through some kind of court case or... Something that has to do with um, them losing a lot of money. Okay. I feel like you, you may even just cut this person off. Yeah, they're going through some kind of court case here. They're going through some kind of court case. Yeah, they're coming in begging, collective. They want to bargain. I feel like this person has some money issues. Um, I feel like they're going to tell you. They're going to tell you that, here's the thing, I know for sure this person is obsessed about you. They're going to tell you that they're in love with you here and that they want to commit, but I feel like this is this person's way of, uh, they see a way out of their money problems if they get with you. And I feel like you're thinking that they're only in here to use you, okay? Um, maybe coming in for passion and desire, right? Um, and you're going to want proof. I, I feel like you don't even know about the legal trouble this person is having. Um, yeah, and it's all being caused by a karmic here in this karmic situation. Uh, or this could be a karmic. I, I feel like this could be somebody who may drink a lot. Maybe they gambled. You know, this could be somebody who gambles a lot. Or um, they're about to take a big risk here. I feel like, yeah, I feel like they're coming in promising you the world, but really, I feel like this person is stuck in some legal trouble, and it's costing them a lot of money, and they see you as being very abundant here. Um, you're not speaking to this person. You're like, I want, you know, you're thinking, I want nothing to do with this right now. You're doing your thing, treating yourself to a glitter box of popcorn. Um, I feel like they see you as their, their ticket to freedom. Okay. Yeah. You've got all of this money and they're over here praying, please, please give me some help in this situation. 
they're in a hole. That's what this is. You got all the money and they're going to be in a hole. Yeah, you're the divine feminine here. Somebody, there's a karmic too, or um, they could be with a karmic or just met somebody that they could have gotten pregnant, playing on their heartstrings for money, for child support. I feel like this person got somebody pregnant and they're looking at child support. I feel like they're ending it with that person, um, whoever they got pregnant with, but they still need to pay. They still need to pay. I feel like this person fell into a trap. And they're looking at you. You're their ticket out of this, collective. You're the one with all the money. Yeah, this person could even pop up on you today. Okay, for someone, this person's coming in today. And I feel like... Um, they're going to they're gonna tell you that that divorce is final. But here's the thing. I feel like they're hiding some things from you. There's, there's children involved in this. They got someone pregnant. They're going to have to pay child support or alimony. And you just don't want any part of this. Look, you don't, you're not going to share your abundance with this person. They, they treated you like you were for, forbidden love. They, they, you were a side like, I feel like you were on the side here. You were somebody that they had a third-party situation with, and and I feel like you were the one who was abandoned. Now this person, they somehow created a baby in this, okay? Or children, there could be children involved. And they may be getting a divorce if this was a marriage. But they're definitely looking at paying out a lot of money. And you're like, look, I worked so hard for all of my abundance. Okay? My abundance. Right? All of these pentacles on your sleeve. This big giant button here on your jacket. You're, you're protecting everything that you've created. You don't want any part of this. You're going to be like, I'm not paying for your child support. I'm not going to be paying for your alimony. You don't get to come in here and join me in my abundance when you left me abandoned in a bad situation to begin with. You know, I feel like that's what you're saying. Yeah, and it's taken this person way too long to come in. The, the time is tick-tock. I feel like they've got no time left, right? And you're out here living kind of, you know, it feels like a lavish life. Um, yeah, protection. Yeah, you're being divinely protected. I feel like this is a karmic situation here that you don't want any part of. You may even, um, you may be led for your own protection because, um, yeah, look, you're done. Lesson learned. Because there's a drama queen somewhere around you that you, I feel like the divine for some of you is leading you maybe on a vacation or a location change, a house move, something like that, a new adventure. Because you learned your lessons and you don't need to be a part of that karma. Yeah, I, I feel like there's a, a, a drama queen out here causing some kind of chaos. Thirsty for money, right? And this masculine, they're in it. They're every day that goes by, they they fall into a deeper and deeper hole. They're in the hole. You're making bank, and yeah, you're walking away from any kind of toxic situation. Any anybody who's got toxic, unhealthy behavior. You're leaving. And I feel like this masculine knows. I feel like they're under a pressure cooker. They may even be enraged. I feel like there's a karmic here that may be enraged too until they they get this money, right? And there's a masculine that is like praying, wanting to talk, wanting to get on the same page with you. What page is that? You taking care of their problems? That's what the, that's the same page they want to get you on is where is the one where you are supporting them and their karma and their karmic issues. Mm -mm. I feel like you're leaving you're being your protection. I feel like you're being led to go somewhere. 
I don't know why. Maybe until all of this dies down or maybe you're just being led to um, move away. I feel like that's part of your protection. Yeah. You're, yeah, I, they got a lot of bills to pay too because uh, whoever they've been with here that they could have gotten pregnant has been living beyond their means, just racking up the credit card bills, man. So they've got credit card bills, they've got child support, they could have alimony, and this person, they don't know what to do about it. They don't know what to do. They 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 feel like their only chance out of this is to get back with you and and use your abundance. Yeah, I don't think that's going to happen. I feel like you're being led and protected here by Archangel Michael. Feel like you're being led to leave, running, avoiding feel like that's you you're being led to leave you um yeah awareness something's going to be coming out to light yeah this person's going to say they want to commit to you if they come and talk to you but i feel like you have this realization all right um even if they did show up to offer you a couple of i feel like it's going to be emotional at me make you feel sad because you know that they're only coming in um to use you for money that's they see you as their way out of this that's sad man you know and i feel like archangel michael is trying to lead you away from this that's really the feeling that i'm getting you may even be um being led to go you know make a house move change locations right and I feel like me at that point you'll find the right love because um, this is a blessing this ace of cups but it's coming to your awareness like you're finding out you're going to be realizing that this person's in a hole and they need your money to get them out of it unfortunately yeah, anyway, collective, um, that's what I've got for this quick check-in. I hope this helps. I hope it resonates with you. Um, like and subscribe, right, if you like this vibe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.